cusp of uh, polymers, it is biodegradable polymers. So very well known plastic has been the most, uh, you know, uh, uh, these days, which is causing cancer, you know, right? So it has uh, been uh, like uh, usage of polythene, uh, polyester, all these things. So it has been a challenge to the environment. So to prevent this, we are going to study about the preparation of biodegradable polymers. So whenever I speak about biodegradable polymers, the first important thing I have to write is, it is a polyester compound. Right? So because you get an ester bond in between, so the biodegradable polymers are polyester compounds, which are biodegradable degradable and cause no pollution. So that's why we call it as biodegradable polymer. So when I, when I have to take the example of this, right? That is right. How to name this compound? Basically, you start with writing poly. Okay? Yes. Then you can start writing beta hydroxy. Right? Beta hydroxy butyrate. It's butanoic acid. The first is butyrate. O. That same thing again. Don't write poly. Poly already we've written again, right? Beta hydroxy. Beta hydroxy. Here butyrate, here it is valerate. So the full form is PHBB. This is biodegradable poly polyhydroxy butyrate and valerate. If you have to write this, basically this beta hydroxy butanoic acid plus beta hydroxy pentanoic acid. Let us write the structures. So beta hydroxy butanoic. First write butanoic acid. One, two, three, four. They name this one, two, three, four. So this is uh, 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 carboxylic acid. This is alpha carbon. This is beta carbon. For the beta carbon, you have hydroxyl group. Now fill in. Right, now let's come back and fill this. Now we said alpha and this is beta. Now let us fill the hydrogens. This is 3 here. For this carbon, 1, 2, 3 and 4. For this carbon, already 2 bonds are there in 2. So what is this called? This is called beta hydroxy butanoic acid. 4 carbons. Butanoic acid. Done. After that, we are going to add beta hydroxy pentanoic acid. Again, write 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, pentanoic acid, 5 carbons, it's a COOH, the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, beta hydroxy, this is alpha carbon and this is beta carbon. So, you're going to write OH. Okay, let me write on the top. So, it's easy to, for me to take out OH. Done. Now, fill in hydrogens, 3 here, 2 here, 1 here, 2 here, done. So, these two together undergo, let us write the name also. This is beta hydroxy pentanoic acid pentanoic acid now there is a condensation polymerization occurring where there is a removal of water molecule then i'm going to remove two water molecules just observe where am i removing i'm going to remove one h from here observe carefully one oh from here one done so one h and one oh over after that i'm going to remove one h from here one oh from here how are they going to link? Now two water molecules are done. How are they going to now start? Now here you, you are going to end your chain. First put a square bracket like this. Now your oxygen will end the chain in this way. Done. Then you have your CH. To that CH you have CH3 linked. Done. After that you have CH2. Then you have, observe carefully, C double bond OO, ester linkage, C double bond OO, that is how you said polyester compound. So, C double bond O is over, now done. You have this carbon, isn't it, where your, uh, this one is like, link that. You take this as a side chain, this whole thing, drop it down as a side chain, CH2, CH3, done. This part is here, this H is also there, okay, let us write that H also done one two three four and this whole chain is down let us make this further done after this we are coming back to the alpha carbon ch2 
and now CO and end the chain like this. So observe carefully H from here OH from here. So it's you're ending with CO. Hydrogen from here OH from here. So you are ending with OH. So this is your ester linkage. This is called pH. This, uh, this whole thing is called pHBV polyhydroxy bitterate and validate combination. You are getting this biodegradable polymer. Observe carefully. This carbon is here with hydrogen. That oxygen is taken as a termin terminal oxygen. The CH3 is down. The CH2 when I just come down, this is also there. The COO is forming an ester linkage. This CH where hydrogen is lost, OH is lost. You are getting the side chain now. CH2 and CO. This is called PHPB.